there's so many. Lisa! Lisa, I'm gonna need you to cancel my appointments. There's a lot of reports to deal with here. Yeah? What do you, what do you want? Amber, I told you before, I'm doing my best. There's a lot of reports here. Well, maybe you should think about that whenever you're putting your videos out, huh? Okay. I'm sorry, I'll get it done. I love you too, Queen. Lisa, can you can you get an intern in here? Or, or maybe a few of them? No. No. Hello. And welcome to another commentary from my channel. You guys have to realize... My girlfriend? This is the best thing that has ever happened to me. I'm 100% positive that she's my soulmate. We're back with another crappy Amber video today. I'm in a new chair. Yeah, I finally got a new chair. I really, I really needed it. Did you see the old chair? My god. I'm not dead! But I wanted to make a video today talking about the new mass reporting surrounding Amberlynn's content. Yeah, there's been a lot of things thrown around, a lot of threats made. Is that a threat? But are they actually being followed up on? Um... It's up for you to decide. You know, there are a lot of us in the Amberverse. Some of us drive luxury vehicles, and some of us ride on unicycles. Me, I drive a Volvo station wagon. So if you're ready, grab yourself a clipboard and call the police. Because we are headed towards the Amberverse. Working on this editing might take a couple hours. Make some bagels taste sour, then I take a shower. Here we go again. Amazon unboxing till it makes me feel better. Then I'll cover up the comments like some stretches in my sweater. Ready? Ain't felt this good since I broke up with Becky. I get my Torrid on, I'm feeling sexy like Miss my pill reminders cause I'm on too many meds Yeah, I gotta stay in bed, but I'm feeling good <laughs> I don't do my taxes, I might need some help I don't plant a garden, I get lettuce off the shelf I don't wanna work hard, I just want the clout I don't like my girlfriend, so I switch them out I don't wear a seatbelt, it only slows me down When I order Uber Eats, I gotta have the hash browns Yeah, I got a couple lawsuits, I had to leave town I don't have a license, my mom drives me around. Target haul, toward haul, don't check the price, I got it. That money stacking up like those calories I count. There is some kind of massive truck outside. If you hear that, I'm sorry. Gotta get that work done. They took our jobs! Yeah, they're down, took our jobs! So people have been complaining about Amber vlogs for a while now, saying that they are boring, <laughs> uh, that she doesn't go anywhere, a lot of things. Um, and I, I can't help but agree with that. And they've tried to encourage her, you know, uh, this 500 pound woman to do things, to go out and do things that will improve her health, improve her mental state, uh, maybe improve her attitude. Now this has been going on since 2019 uh, or whenever she first got, yeah, there's a big drug. Like the jobs. They took your job. They took your job. So this has been going on since 2019 or whenever her and Jade, my girlfriend, wifey, I'm a Hufflepuff. Wh whatever, <laughs> whenever they first got together, which I think is contradictory because it seemed like a new character, a new side character on the Amberlynn program, if you want to call it that, would only be a good thing, right? You know, something new, something fresh. It's Noah's Arcade. It's chill, it's fresh, it's Noah's Arcade. Of course, that's not what we got, and you probably know the rest of how we got here. Just a long, sad, vlogging story. So whenever Wifey finally left, uh, I think a lot of people were expecting change. Maybe a change for the better. And we definitely got a change, but is it better? So with the move to Oklahoma comes a lot more time with Mom, a lot more eating, a lot more drinking, a lot more filming, all of that. Oh, and way more clickbaiting. Way more, a lot. Of clickbaiting. From talking about needing a new caretaker to having a new boyfriend or publishing her writings, uh, how about saying, just straight up saying gambling addiction. This, it's all lies. That's a lie. So that in combination with her continual and excessive eating content, it's it's a recipe for disaster. It's led to a bit of bad press, so to speak. Now there is gonna tell me how much I have to f around to find out what I need to find out. A rise in clickbait for Amber will inevitably lead to a rise in reports, reporting. Or at least that's what they say. But are these reports actually happening? Yes, the answer is yes, they are totally happening. Amber is crazy. I have heard from multiple individuals that they are now reporting Amber for clickbait and have done so multiple times. In fact, I have personally seen some of those reports. This is, that's, it's happening. And as long as Amber keeps clickbaiting, she's, it's gonna keep happening. But as Amber has said before, Shane Dawson does it, so I can too. Conclusion. With so much reporting going on, you're probably wondering, what does this actually do? Does this, does this do anything? Because it never seems like it does anything. 
and unfortunately, it, it pretty much means nothing. Almost nothing happens. Nothing! YouTube, the way that it currently is, being mostly automated, means that a single or even a few reports often just get overlooked. If there are a substantial amount of muggles, non-complaining folks, <coughs> who also watch the video, then it's all about ratio. Basically, as long as most of the viewers of a video aren't complaining, then YouTube isn't gonna complain either. They don't care. They're just there to make money. <laughs> but I will say this, Amber should be careful. It's not a threat! Professor Moody! It's not a threat! Because even if YouTube does nothing about a few reports here and there, they're still watching what's going on. And if you keep getting reported, they're noting that, and they're gonna note just how many times it happens, because eventually, they're gonna start doing something about it. Stop right there! Stop. But hey, that's just my opinion! And with that, we have been teleported out of the Amberverse once again. That's right, Amber called up FBI Frank. You know, he's threatening us with legal action, so... I guess we're just leaving. All of you, get out of here. I'd like to thank everybody for watching this totally normal and not special episode of You Guys Have to Realize. And remind everyone that these videos are put out for entertainment purposes only. Please do not send any hateful or disparaging remarks. God, I love this chair. To myself or anyone mentioned in these videos, thanks again for watching, and I will see you guys in the next one. Yeah, they listen up when I conduct. When I come around, you wanna post up. Baby, go and get your player unstuck and get the red bag and grab the makeup. Nothing in my pocket, but I still know how to rock it. Want a new player? You just need to unlock it. Catch me on the guns or come find me in the cockpit. Friend of nature, Davy Crockett. Hold up. Made a couple friends, they say I am on the glow up. Better look twice, baby, I'm about to blow up. Going high speed and I ain't about to slow up. All you gotta do is show up. Bus to move where the games are played. It's chill, it's fresh, it's Noah's Arcade. Epithetic facts, and you guys have to realize in the house. Yeah, I thought I seen that, but I wasn't for sure. Old, like ancient. Like animals to me are like old. Uh, I'm almost out of jukes. This is like four hours old. Lisa! Lisa! Le Lisa! I found a box of raisins. What the hell are these doing here? Oh my god, they're all stuck together. Who likes these? Oh, the taste is... Oh, the texture. Oh my god. Don't even try them. Don't even try them. Raisins are bad. All of you get out of here. I mean it.